Good evening, Cold Lake Ice fans. I'm here with Scott Hood as the Cold Lake Ice fell 3-2 to the Wainwright Bisons. So, Scott, you guys definitely gave up a power play goal and definitely a big factor that caused you guys to lose tonight. I don't know. I'm not going to say exactly it cost us a loss. Uh, you know, the th first period was crazy. I mean, back and forth, they scored a shorthanded goal with 28 seconds left to uh, take the lead. We had plenty of chances through the second and third to uh, even up, but we battled hard. I mean, that's the first place team in the league for the last four years, so we got to we got to take some credit ourselves. You know, we're, we're working hard right now, and, you know, just the bounce didn't go our way tonight. Definitely played a good game last week in uh, Wainwright as well, as Matt Hemwood definitely stood up in net tonight and stopped some crucial shots. Yeah, you know what? I mean, both our goalies, I mean, Jaden Chase, uh, you know, the scores weren't uh, definitely in his favor, but he's played well. Um, Henny, you know what? Like I said, I can say the same thing over and over from him last last year and this year. He's been a, he's been a rock back there and played well for the last two games against Wainwright. Last night in St. Paul, definitely another crazy game. Five goals in the first period, but unfortunately, just didn't go your way in overtime yesterday. No, that was a that was a tough one. We were up three nothing and just didn't keep our foot on the gas, obviously, and let them back in it. Uh, there's gonna be no easy games in this league this year, so it's uh, it's gonna be a battle every night. And you know, so far we've uh, responded well. Um, our record doesn't show, but we're seeing some progress now. You guys got Vermilion and Wainwright next week. What do you guys need to work on in practice to prepare for those games coming up? Uh, just the same things we work on every week. I think it's uh, it's key to, you know, D-zone, obviously, power play. Just the basics, you stay focused and, you know, maybe try to get these guys in shape a bit. But, you know, it's it's another week. It's going to be a battle against Vermillion. Vermillion's on a bit of a streak now. And, and you know, obviously, we're it again for the third week in a row. But we'll uh, we'll give it our best. All right. uh, we'll do it tonight for the Imperial Oil Place Arena as the Cold Lake Heights fall to 3-4-1. and one, As we'll be back here on November 2nd against the Wainwright Bisons.